The theme this year is moving forward. After last year's cancellation of the National Dominican Day Parade due to the worldwide pandemic, this year, chair of the organization, Christina Contreras, held a press conference with her board at the Manhattan Neighborhood Network, El Barrio Community Media Center, to make this announcement. The parade is August 8th, this is Sunday, and the hours are going to be from 12 to 3. The show will go on beginning at 43rd Street and 6th Avenue and heading north to 52nd Street. NYPD is partnering with us, they're coordinating the logistical components so people can still see the, the celebration and the production and still maintain some social distance. We encourage everybody to wear the mask. Uh, we don't want people to, you know, expose themselves. We want to make sure we keep guidelines and keep everyone safe. Safe in a year that impacted every aspect of life, including higher education, among the honorees this year was president of New York State Higher Education, Dr. Guillermo Linares, who shared these words of encouragement. At a time when, when we are faced with so many challenges, as we see that we're conquering uh, COVID-19, I want to uh, urge all Dominicans, all New Yorkers to stay strong uh, and to continue moving forward. Also there receiving honors, Dr. Yomaris Peña, an internal medicine physician at Somos Community Care. We talked about the community she serves. Dominicans struggle every day. We are the blood of the city of New York because we try to overcome those the fears and, and create a better future for us, but also for our families. The organization that has raised nearly one million in scholarships for college students since 2015 is preparing to see that continue. And 18-year-old Cristina Cruz Jimenez is among those hoping to receive one. I'm so grateful being around all of these people. Um, well, for example, the lady that's in the Bar Association, it was crazy to meet her. Like to have a Hispanic woman, a Dominican woman so young to like succeed. All these people that succeeded despite like the odds. And me after the show. Vamos para el party. <laughs> Among those performing at the parade will be Brian Bautista, who won America's Heart as a contestant on The Voice. This year we've gone through a lot. And it's been a rough year. But at the same time, it's important for me to perform because it lets people know that we can also persevere after a time like this, you know? The parade will be streaming live on ABC and the National Dominican Day Parade's YouTube channel. For more information on the parade and how to celebrate virtually or in person, go to natddp.org. For BronxNet, this is Arlene Makoko.